Most people spend a lot of time surfing the internet and here's several tips for how to do it that much more quickly on your Mac. I'm in Safari and I have two tabs open here, Google and Amazon.com. So the first thing is, is that if I want to enter in and go to a new website, on this tab here in Google, I do not have to click up here and backspace through that entire web address. I can actually just hit the keyboard command, Command L. Now the command button is to the left and right of your space bar. That will highlight the entire web address. I just start typing the first few letters of where I want to go. I do not even need to type www. So if I want to go to Lowe's.com, I just type in L-O-W-E-S, hit enter. That takes me to that web page. Now, if instead I wanted to open a new web page but have it in its own tab, I don't want to leave Google, then I can hit Command-T and I can type in where I want to go, the first few letters, and hit Enter. So now I did not want to leave Lowe's.com. I wanted to go to Google and I've kept Lowe's.com open here as a tab. Another couple of tips on this Amazon page, you can install extensions in Safari. One is called Hover Zoom, and this lets me just move my mouse over the top of an image and view that image in full size without having to click on it. That speeds things up for me. And then also, if I want to open another web page from a link on, another, on this web page, but I don't want to load it on top of what I'm looking at, then I hold down the command button before I click it, and that will open that link in a new tab. And so what that lets me do is I still have this page open where I'm shopping maybe for my camera, and I have a new tab open over here where I'm going to shop for memory cards. So those are just a few very quick tips. We teach you how to do all of this at I Rock My Mac in a little more detail. So check it out, and I hope this helped.